Hey guys, Alex from Moonlight Tarot is here with your monthly forecast. Uh, this is a tarot reading based on your astrological sign. This video is for Taurus's sun sign in Western astrology, moon and rising sign in Eastern Vedic astrology. And uh, please remember that this is a general reading. It may be for you, it may be not for you. So take what resonates and leave the rest to other people. If it's not your message, check out my other videos. I have pick a cards, I have numerology forecasts. And... Uh, if it is for you, I would really love to hear from you what you think about it, uh, how much it resonated with you. You can come back and check in the end of the month to have uh, the full picture. So we have general energy, the beginning of the month, changes, challenges, your love life, money and energy in the end of the month. So let's start. Ooh. I want to see one more card. We have three of swords and we have six of cups. But I don't feel like it's disappointment. I feel it's the contrary. Um, healing, new growth where the past disappointments were. Because um, maybe you are meeting somebody new. Maybe you are be beginning to believe that for most of you it's like I will love again. I will meet somebody. Uh, I am ready for... Uh, another go, another try. With this Nine of Pentacles here, you are looking good, you are taking care of yourself, you are believing in yourself, you are stable, you like financially, emotionally, you know your worth. Like whatever is happening, and yeah, it's more, more like healing of old wounds and being ready for another, how to say, another chance for love. Okay, let's see the beginning of the month. Okay. Yeah, there is some switch switch of energy happening for you, Tauruses. So maybe currently you have too much on your plate and you will be shifting from being burdened, being tired, being worried to a much more positive vibe like enjoying things, being open. We have again nine and we have nine here too. It's like you're deciding to enjoy your life no matter what what is happening around no matter what is going on it's like i will be happy with what i have and it's it's the best it's the best attitude by the way it's just if you want to have more things to enjoy or to be grateful for in life you need to start enjoying what you have already and life will bring more things for you to be happy about it's like uh, the law of manifestation, if you know what I'm talking about. And it seems like you will be the embodiment of this law of manifestation in April 2020. Hmm. Let's move to the changes. We have Queen of Pentacles and we have Two of Swords. And I want to see more. What will be changing for you in April 2020 for Tauruses? Hmm. Definitely finding some balance. Finding some ground and one more. King of Pentacles. So, one thing I see here. Um, your finances, I will, we will see more, but it seems like maybe your finances won't be doing as good as you would like them to be because um, everybody seemed to be affected by the crisis because of the coronavirus like so many businesses are going online or if it's possible so it will be a crisis for everybody but it seems like even though you are not getting as much abundance as you would like to to see in your life uh, in April you will find a balance, you will maintain your inner peace, your inner balance, you will be like, I will be grateful for what I have, I am healthy, I am safe, or my, my family is safe, whatever is positive, you will be focusing on the positive side, and you will be um, seeking for this inner balance, and whatever is grounding you, whatever is giving you a sense of stability, whatever is giving you a sense of uh, protection, so yeah, maybe, maybe, finances are not perfect but you are finding peace with whatever is going on you're not asking yourself a question why is it is this happening for me with me you're asking yourself a question what for it is happening with me so um what can i learn from it very 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 positive outlook on everything challenges what will be your challenge 
lovers and the hermit uh, most probably you will be in um, in quarantine for a while and choosing to stay indoors choosing to be withdrawn choosing to kind of stay in solitude will be difficult will be difficult will be a challenge well it will be a challenge for the most people in the planet but by staying in oh you're walking away from drama we have six of swords and we have eight of cups it seems like you will be leaving behind definitely with this ten of wands uh leaving it behind leaving the problems the maybe hysteria maybe you started panicking or you're currently panicking but you will be coming down a lot and you're like i don't want no more panic no more drama no thank you i will focus on what i have in my arms here in my hands you see like this lotus flower um that this guy is carrying it's like i will focus on what i have on the beautiful things i have on the positive things i have and i will not uh, give in to panic or drama or for some of you, there is some kind of additional drama in your life. And you're like, there is, how to say, I am choosing to not let myself be drowned in it. So you are walking away from something, from panic and some also external drama in your life. That's good. Let's see. It, it, it won't be easy because you might have been stuck in this. Uh, sense of being overwhelmed or being heartbroken something negative um, maybe currently you are in this situation but April April will be much more positive for you okay let's see but it's kind of it won't happen on its own you need to make some effort to walk away from this negative mindset it's up to you guys but you totally can do this and you will be feeling uh, like doing it in April so let's see what about your love life another lover's card hmm. let's see more we have the world eight of Pentacles and the lovers Wow, Ace of Cups, Ace of... Oh, come on, seriously, three Aces. Huh. You are making some choice. You are making some choice, definitely, with the world and three Aces. You are completely, I don't know, some, some choices that you're going to make will change your love life, like for good, you know? Uh, because with this Eight of Pentacles, you will start doing things, again, changing your actions choosing different kind of actions and creating something different for yourself is going to lead you to something beautiful come on three aces and okay one one last card one last card for your love life it seems like you, you will be the one to offer somebody this um new vision if you are in a relationship you will be able to have a new vision of your relationship uh, maybe you will learn how to appreciate your relationship more uh, it's not necessary that you're having a new relationship no you're changing your attitude to what you already have you're learning to be happy with what you have right remember about that so uh and this change of attitude is going to bring impressive like amazing results seriously amazing and uh, this will be the result of your choices again changing your behavior doing things differently investing into your relationship or for those of you who are not in the relationship you will be the one to offer uh to have this new beginning to start this new beginning with somebody it's like i have this for you i have my love for you so let's do this for some of you it can be friendship for of all friendships for others um, it can be romance but it seems like being in solitude or in quarantine like going through this uh situation the world crisis you will be able to take your relationships to another level and it, it's a major change with the world and three aces guys again the result will be uh it will be the result of your actions changing your actions hmm. and having a new vision of something this is great 
I'm loving your energy. So, what about your money? You really need to be smart about money. With this Four of Pentacles, King of Swords, and Ace of Swords, spend, be careful with spending, start now. And there is something you need to invest. So, again, think critically, spend carefully, and cut your spendings only to what's necessary. Like, be very, very... Uh, clear about what you spend your money on uh you will have to change your shopping i don't know habits routine completely you need to become better with money so it has been coming <laughs> for a long time maybe so yeah again we have two aces here so you have some new vision about your relationship and about your finances as well. Uh, some changes you, you needed to make, the changes, uh, and also there is an attitude towards money, to what you have. It will be changed. It will be transformed, like, for good. You will be much happier with what you have, and you will be much happier with less. Maybe you will become a minimalist, I don't know, um, through this experience, because you will be much happier as the result with less spending and again it has been coming for a while this lesson you needed this lesson about money but overall there is nothing super negative you will have a new attitude a new vision and overall it your finances will be okay let's see let's see your energy in the end of the month so in the end of the month facing uh may we have the star and we have five of swords but let's see a little bit more about this energy some again we have another nine of cups seven of cups and five of swords two fives it seems like you will um stop fighting either with yourself or with somebody else again five of swords and five of swords you're putting an end to some uh, inner conflict and you will be seeking opportunities how to make your for some of you, it's your dream come true for others it's your wish come true for third group it's just how to make your life more more positive with the star and the um, nine of cups yeah there is something you would like to add it and it won't be materialistic it won't be materialistic it, it will be something spiritual like you will um, have a new goal and uh, you're definitely putting an end to something that has been tormenting you torturing you and with this page of wands it seems like you will be starting having new ideas again new ideas new vision new beginnings you have a, a lot of it like you seriously all aces are in your hands so many of them come on and you will be like i have a new vision about my life and now i i want uh different things and different things are going to make me happy and you will be asking yourself how do I make this happen or that happen and again your energy is very positive you're leaving behind the negativity and finding the balance in whatever you have finding the joy and it's gonna change and transform you and your life tremendously well my dear Tauruses your reading is amazing I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did and uh, hope to hear from you what you think uh, you may also decide to come back in the end of April to see how it resonated with you during the month. You will have the, the full picture by then. And uh, I always love to read, uh, read your updates. Well, have a great day, have a great month and have a great life. See you soon. Bye, guys.